Must be this big. <laughs> Yo, what up dudes? So welcome back to another sailing video. I'm back home now. I stopped sailing two weeks ago. My body still hurts. These videos you'll get to see the struggle, the adventure, the workout, just hard work, sleepless nights. You get to see all of that, all the mistakes, everything we did wrong, everything we did right. And eventually we went from a crew of six down to a crew of three. And you get to see the whole thing. So this is, uh, yeah, first episode back. I've got three or four more episodes after this. And then I am doing the hike across England that I've been talking about. That's the next series. You'll be seeing a whole week's worth of hiking videos from England. Uh, so yeah, as these videos are going up, I'll be walking. Uh, but yeah, this is the first video. This is the moon. So we've arrived in Torquay. We came here to get some sail repairs done and we were dropping off two of our crew. Now these were the guys that taught us everything. They taught us how to sail in like two weeks. And we did most of it just by sitting on the boat and talking. Now they're leaving us. So it's just me, Dunk and my dad. The first morning we were there, one of our neighbors needed some work done on their mast. So obviously they recruited me, because I'm the most nimble of the crew. And yeah, said, said hello. And then about to climb their mast. In it, just sit in it. Yeah. These little harnesses that I'm in, they're not comfortable. <laughs> yeah, I just have to pull my weight up and everybody else hoists me up. Uh, this mast is pretty tall, it's about twice the height of the mast on our boat. Someone had basically got a, a thin line tied in with their okay. thicker lines. Yep. So their ropes were tied to another rope and it shouldn't be in there. It was like a string type rope. How's your morning going? You know, just climbing another mast here in Torquay. Stop, 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 stop! The safety line won't go any further. <laughs> There's no movement on this. There's no movement on the mousing line. Do you want to hoist me slightly higher? I can see if I can unlodge it. Wait, wait, wait. I can, I can see what's happened to it. It's wrapped yourself around two, two ropes and then gone back up. Black and white and blue and white. If I tie it to the black and white, maybe you can pull it down through, because it's moving. I managed to get the line free. Now this couple can have their boat back. yee So then we decided to explore a bit of Torquay because we knew we were going to be here for a few days. We're not going to sail for a little bit. So my friends Joey and Chelsea, they decided to come down and Yoshi went on a little beach adventure. Here they are, getting up to some mischief as always. I agree. The whole time I've been away sailing, I've been concentrating on TikToks. Just thinking of like interesting TikTok ideas. Um, I'm really having a lot of fun with the app. If you didn't know I have TikTok, <laughs> go check me out. Be fair time. There's some videos on there that I've been I've been playing around with, you know. I've been taking YouTube giving a, I've been giving YouTube a break while I've been sailing. I do. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> oh, you got shoes?
Bro, you could have done that. That was a piece of cake. <laughs> That's like a minute and a half. That was easy. That was easy. Oh, people up there too. Cool. Good hang off the end. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> Wait for high tide and then and then jump it. That's a hell of a cliff jump, dude. That's a hell of a cliff jump. <laughs> Whew. I'm on a run. <laughs> 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 yeah. Not ours. Some rain coming in. Quickly. <laughs> Myself. I might have drooled a little bit. So this is my complicated charging setup. This is why I didn't manage to post a video every day. I had to plug an inverter into the battery and take the bed apart so that I could charge my laptop whenever I wanted to. The water on the floor. <laughs> You'll leave a comment if you saw this on TikTok first. So Duncan had this idea. We were harboured up next to this rock. And Duncan really wanted to go swim to the rock. So one day we had some time to ourselves. And uh, that's what we... That was it. <laughs> There's no like easing into this. You just have to go in. Now these waters are just jellyfish infested. You'll see them everywhere in a second. This sailing trip was the first time I've really used the GoPro on my chest. Somebody bought me a chest mount from my wishlist. Uh, wish wishlist link, link down below if you want to help me buy uh, YouTube supplies. Yeah, this chest mount is just awesome. It gets some really interesting perspectives. I used it quite a lot on the boat because uh, there's no risk of it getting damaged from the water. And I never had to hold it or do anything. I could just press a button or leave it. It would be stuck to my chest. So yeah, you'll be enjoying a lot of that content in these new videos coming up. I'm new to voiceovers. Enjoy the footage. What's up guys? We haven't done any updates in a few days because we've just been stuck in Torquay. Well, 
I was stuck, we've been working in Torquay, but now it's just the three of us, and then in a few days we've got some more people joining us. We're about to take the boat out ourselves for the first time ever. I guess Duncan and I are in charge right now. We've got the solar panel fitted yesterday, my uncle came down to do it. So now we've got power, it was self-sufficient. I'll be at the helm, so I'm going to switch to GoPro. I'm ready to go now. You ready, Dunk? Ready as I'll ever be. All right. <laughs> Nice. Alright Dunk, do you want to just check that there's nothing like dangling? Keep up the as they are for now. Any lines? <laughs> hey, we're moving. The reason I love this footage is because this was the first time that we were sailing the boat, well, motoring the boat, on the ocean by ourselves after learning theory and doing a bit of practical for two weeks on sailing. We really didn't really know anything about sailing coming into this trip. I've done a bit of sailing in the past, but nothing really to prepare me for this. Torquay's a couple miles over there. And now we're going to be chilling in this little bay for the next four, five days, the whole weekend probably. Uh, we've, we've figured out how to use the anchor, so now we shouldn't be moving. And then tomorrow we'll take the tender over there, a little dinghy, and go explore the woods. I'll show you around. We've got a forest over there that we can explore. The forest over here, and then that's where the town is. So we might go, yeah, we'll go do that tomorrow. Have a look, look around. Do some swimming. It's a boat update. We took this sail off. The Genoa is being repaired. The mast is being repaired on Tuesday. The sail will be back on Monday. The sailors, experienced one, the three that are joining us to go to Spain, are going to be here Monday. Now we sleep and hopefully don't drift. And that's the update. We'll pick you guys up tomorrow. No, we shouldn't. <laughs> we shouldn't. Right. But that's where we've been the past few days. That's where we left the rest of our crew that weren't joining us. Now it's just us, us three. Until next week. And then it's go time. We're actually going to Spain. We're actually doing it. And so yeah, that was the first time we'd anchored on our own in the yacht with no experienced sailors. It was such an awesome night and a great feeling. It's like we were truly starting our own adventure. Anyway, episode two will come out tomorrow if you guys are enjoying. Hope you liked the little voiceover. Leave a like on the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new here. Sorry, I'm chewing candy. I'm like really stoned, but yeah. See you guys tomorrow.